a month ago we got the Israel it was the U5 and uh, we we don't film videos on day one very well because I was like what's this throttle thing doing it, it was cruise control turns out this is a really good little bike and I've been using it for work I've really been enjoying it I'm going to be modifying it to hold a bunch of tools and stuff but before I do that I want to enjoy it we happen to be going to visit some family in New Jersey and we're in Ocean Township Joe was a Palea Joe Palea Park and uh, while our relatives are doing disc golf I figure we can ride it around a little bit and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna go around then I'm gonna come back and steal the camera from you all one shot okay it's not too bad this bike's actually pretty um, this bike's actually really light and it's easy to fold up and move our bigger bike was really difficult to do like it's really difficult to put in the back of the car I'm gonna head on back now. Oh, feel that wind. Got a storm coming in, but better than the uh, the really hot weather. I might need to clean my brakes a little bit. I've been doing some landscaping work and I've uh, been using this to, dri to drive around. I think with a, just a little bit of an adaptation of building a bigger rack in the back, and adding a PVC pipe so I can put a shovel on here. This is going to be perfect. You know, because I don't want to have to rent a truck. You know. May I have the camera? Thank you. I'm going to go to uh, 0.5 zoom. What I like about this most is the low speed control is amazing. Because with our other bike... The, uh, the low speed control kind of cuts off around 8 miles an hour, but with this, you can go down to like 3 miles an hour. You can go down to basically the, the minimum that you can balance on. We'll get to sneak up on our family members. Hello, you two. Hello. That's uh, Thais's twin sister and her husband. This is so beautiful. This bike has a lot of like really good power in the the rear motor, and uh, I feel like I could probably pull a trailer with it to pull, uh, to get some use out of it. I say let's go back and uh, catch up with Thice because I feel bad that we didn't bring two bikes today, but uh, bringing the one was a little bit of a pain because I ended up getting a whole milk crate full of tools and stuff at a local uh, uh, shop. Oh, right, it's a, a freewheel back, backwards. Well, you want to give it a ride? Yeah, sure. Okie dokie. Did you do a loop? I, I just went down there and they came back because I didn't want to get too far from you. Okay. But you can do a loop and I'll meet you over there. Yeah, you know, I got some bad news. What? My phone's stuck in headphone jack mode now. Uh-oh. So I have the headphone jack out, but it still thinks head, head, the headset's put in. So no audio anymore. No. <laughs> Don't know what that means. So you can't record? I might be able to record, but it keeps thinking there's a headphone jack in. Oh. 
uh, as Lori, so I can't like listen to the uh, audio playback. Oh, and I got my phone to, I got my phone to finally not think there was a headset in. So I don't know, maybe it, it recorded the audio. It did, so that's good. That's accurate. So that's They're at the. Uh, they're making their way to the next hole. Okay. This is kind of neat. You want to explain it? Why? Yeah, because oh. you're the one that's going to show me. I mean, yeah, basically, it shows you where you need to aim through all those trees. I'm so oh. glad you said that because, like, I, I don't, I don't, I don't know what's going on. Here. Yeah, I've seen mm -hmm. those. I've seen those. Uh, was it Earhart? No, it's not Earhart. <laughs> uh, disc golf. Disc, disc golf. golf. Yeah. yeah. Sports. Yeah. Uh, I seen those things around. I was like, is it for like young owls to live in or something? <laughs> I know. I never knew what those were either. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't the, know. The disc basket. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what it's actually called, but yeah. I do love that it looks like uh -huh. Legend of Zelda. Yep. That's cool. Ah, beautiful. A little bit of poison ivy there, so I won't be going in there. Oh, actually, a lot of poison ivy there. Oh, man. Okay, let's just move down a little bit. That serene spot is just as good as this serene spot. If you had another huge poison... Oh, these are all poison ivy vines. I should come down here with a hatchet. Okay, well, the serene spot is a little bit... Uh, um scary due to the poison ivy now here's something you guys should keep an eye out for tick bites have gotten really bad lately because um, i believe there is a protein or something that are spreading through ticks called i think the alpha gal syndrome or something like that where if you get bitten by some infected ticks you can get get sick if you eat meat so be careful about that if you live in the uh, the southern united states or the midwest or the East Coast, because that's got really bad. This is beautiful. In general, I think that New Jersey has strange infrastructure, but um, like everything's a highway in some places. But I do like it. They have a nice state. Ooh. This is an interesting area. Very interesting. You could film a movie here. At least I could. Yeah, I feel bad that the first review video for this isn't wheel didn't go so well because it was so hot. The summer, the, the heat and the humidity was just awful. And and then I, we, we went down to Forbidden Drive and uh, it was, I think, Wissahickon Park in Philadelphia. And it was really fun, really nice. We're waiting for a few more bike lanes to open up. And then we'll be able to go like to Conshohocken and stuff. We'll be able to go anywhere, but in in Lansdowne, Pennsylvania, there happens to be a few kind of sectioned off places, and uh, it's kind of hard to get away from all the crazy traffic. We've decided to keep this bike because it's better than the bike we bought. The brakes are good. The power is good. The motor strength is good. The structure seems good. I like that it has smaller wheels. You know, thinking back to 2012 when I first started my electric bike videos, uh, I would have called this like the biggest wheel I've ever seen. But now they've gone to really big balloon tires and I've, 
I kind of don't need that in my life. Like, this is more than good enough. This is amazing. I've seen motorcycle tires only barely bigger than this. And what it means is whenever this thing folds up, it easily fit into... Uh, she goes by Brangwen online, but Thais' uh, twin sister. It easily fit into the back of her Honda Accord. I think it was Accord. And uh, really easy to use. Really easy to stow. Oh, whoops. That's why. Must have caught my... My words for the past few sentences weren't very good because I was like, what is wrong? I was processing that while I was trying to say the words that I had queued up in my head. I think this is only like $450 or something like that. And I think you can get it for even cheaper on a discount. It's amazing what quality you can get these days. Oh, this is lovely. Their soil must be very irony out here. I'm going to have to get Thice to come down here. This is such a beautiful spot. You know, I bet this will be beautiful in uh, autumn. Yeah, I think they do have a lot of iron in the soil out here. Yeah, see, like, the low speed control is amazing. I can even go lower. But then I'm having bouncing issues. This low speed control on this bike, it's a big win for me. I actually really like it. There's a few spots when I grew up where the, um, where the, a, a train wrecked with like iron ore. And uh, you could see there was so much iron coming down some of those streams. Be an entire train car of iron ore, I guess. This is beautiful. It's good to take a moment to come to places like this because, you know, like, I presume a lot of other people have, oh, I'd say motivation issues. Now, I also have issues of where I'm just always in pain, but motivation issues of what do you really want to do in life? What do you actually enjoy? Because it's hard to find stuff to enjoy in life and uh, doing stuff like this, that helps bring the enjoyment, the, the enjoyment up. Man, look at this place. You can tell this was like once an industrial waste site. So much stuff just buried here. And yet nature can reclaim it. I'm seeing all sorts of stuff. That there's, there's just stuff all over. This must have been like a, a, a waste dump or something. Maybe something from mining. That looks like conduit down there. Yeah, it looks like half-inch conduit, a whole spool of it. Before long, it'll all be just oxide. Oh, look at that. Wow. Those are some big power cables. <laughs> I almost wonder if... Would I be doing a service coming down here and taking all the metal? I wonder. Or is that part of like some heritage? Like was this some, uh, was this some mi uh, historic mine site or something? It's curious that the water comes out out there. I wonder if the water comes out at such a great speed that it just goes in that direction.
This is cute. If I was in Illinois and I saw that rusty soil, I would be like, oh, there must, must be something thrown in the water, but out here, it might just be how the clay is. It's a nice part. I can see why so many uh, well-off people live around here. Is this a car entrance or is this um, something else? Yeah, I don't necessarily need to be out here. I didn't look at the map. I probably should have. Oh well. I should probably start heading back. Some people worry when I drive one-handed, but I kind of have to with, with a, uh, when I'm filming. And plus, I was kind of born on two wheels, so I'm really good at it. Ten miles an hour is plenty for this. Honestly, it feels a bit fast for me, but it's good for getting through. Loads of people up here. I try not to ruin their day by filming because some people get, well, well, even I would get upset by that. So I usually try not to film like that. All right, let's see where they went. Man, there's so much poison ivy back there. It's all over. I think I see him. I see Thice through the trees, way up there. I do, I do, I do. The long one? The library, the library trail, trail, whatever it's called. Oh, I didn't know it was it called the library. It bridge. That was, uh, it had a, like a little wooden bridge. It's not oh, that it, far. Oh, I didn't see that, but I have a trail for you to see. Oh, yeah? So for, further down that, that one Zelda sign, it's beautiful. Okay. You need to take it right now and go down there. I'll go back that way? Yeah, you want to go down? Because it, it'll, you'll hit a parking lot, and that's when you know to turn around. Okay. If you want. All right. Uh, yeah. I'll show you. Yeah. Plus, we have phones and stuff. Yeah, my phone is only 26% though. Oh, well, either way, we'll meet it back at the car if you, you know. Okay. I mean, I have enough views, but, you know. Yeah, yeah. All right.
And you got more than enough electricity in that bike. Sure do. I felt so cool. I, 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 uh, I saw our shirt like mm -hmm. way through the trees. <laughs> I was like, that's a Final Fantasy shirt. Did you catch any deer? No, I didn't. Oh, we had, there was right after you left, there was one that crossed the path. Oh, it was cute. It would have been a nice, some nice footage for you. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I decided to run off and because no, okay. on an e-bike it's so fun just to go down a trail. That's all right. Um, they mm. yeah they're 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 here. Nice, nice. Oh, there's more deer. Nice. Oh, really? Yeah. Look at this. That is fascinating. I should almost do another video of the fungus finder. I love that lichen. Oh, I find something that I know I like. Is this one of those speed limit signs, I presume? But a solar panel. That is so fascinating. See, this is the case where plastic eating fungus would evolve pretty quickly with all the plastic we've developed. Oh, look at all the birds over there. Well, so I saw. So you, you knew said, exactly what I'm talking about. Yes, it's beautiful. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my God, it's gorgeous. I oh, know. Oh, we gotta come back here with two bikes sometime, or me and a scooter or something like yeah, that. Yeah, we do because uh, wonderful. Does anybody want to cool off riding a bike? I am good. I'm good. Okay. okay. I'm good. Well, you want to end it there? We're out of battery. It's yep. too hot. We're, We're all out that. of battery. The, the phone. Yeah, the phone. My 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 other phone. My phone. The, the deer are tired. Like the deer, the yeah. deer, they're, they're winded. Yeah. And uh, yeah, so there we go. <laughs> Bye. I didn't even decide to look at that before. Oh, that's so lovely. Look at that. That's cool. That's some cool history.